I'm very interested to find out how fast this car went before it crashed. Because off my head, this is just blistering speed. So what I did is just simple distance over uh, time and I cut to calculate his speed. So I pushed this into my Final Cut Pro video editing, editing software. And I took the distance from this location here all the way to the point where I couldn't see the car anymore. If you notice, I moved the frame and the car disappears here. So how did I calculate distance? I went into uh, Google Maps again. Let's say I'm filming from here. So the car sped from here all the way to where the second, this is the first blue shop, the car sped to this second blue shop here. If you calculate the roof up here, it's about 10 roof. So what I do is click a satellite view and I count the roof. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I would just right click, measure distance from here to where he starts speeding. So probably around here. It's about 71 meters. If you input uh, the distance of 71 meters, in the time he took about 1.16. This is not like 100% accurate, but I think this is the best we can get. My video is at 24 frames per second, so I believe this time is correct. And you realize his speed is roughly around 200 kilometers per hour, so that's pretty fast. If you go back to the map itself, you notice that he has a very uh, long straight way to gain 200 kilometers per hour. You see this straight path here. So I'm not surprised he hit 200 kilometers per hour and at this bend before he lost control and whacked into the shop house here. I mean the shop house here. So it probably like kind of like spun out here and hit here.